was the lead author on Hawaii's first ever pork report, the Grassroot Institute's policy analyst, Pearl Hahn. surplus of over $700 million, and the state government was deciding what to do with all our money. While well, they thought of everything from public services and various programs, everything except the obvious solution stipulated in the state constitution in Article 7, Section 6, where it says to rebut the surplus to the taxpayers of Hawaii. It's not a rumor that Kauai citizens pay incredibly high taxes. It is a fact. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, Hawaii ranks second of all 50 states in state taxes per person, a whopping $3,500 per person. Yet, the legislature and city want to tax us even more. Someone needs to point out to them that the states of Colorado, New Hampshire, Texas and South Dakota get along just fine and only charge each person $1,500, less than half of what we pay. Yeah. Our leaders are choosing to ignore that higher taxes will devastate low-income earners. They are choosing to ignore that higher taxes will force employers to lay off workers and, con and contribute to the unemployment rate. They're taking our earnings and sending it into a vacuum, never to be seen again. We are all here to say no. No to more rampant spending, no to more rampant taxing. If we need to demand some responsibility before we are forced to give another dime, so everyone, let's say it over again. No more. coincidence that we've got a rainbow smiling over our Hawaii tax day tea party.